So as you know, in times in life, things sometimes can happen to where they push you into your safety net, to your safety zone. For me, it was the death of my mom. It was a, um, a tragedy for me um, when that happened. It was like basically after, after it happened, it was like I wanted to take the easy way out. And the easy way, when I say the easy way, I'm saying the easy way as in I wanted to protect that pain. So even though I was into fashion and, and fitness, it was like I was doing things halfway. You know, I would do things and then I would, then I would get depressed and I would, you know, I would start thinking about all the things that, you know, that could go wrong or all the things it was holding me back. Before that happened, I was one of those self-driven persons. And if it didn't challenge me and if it didn't push me, I didn't want to have no parts of it. And it had to inspire me. It had to send sparks in order for me to partake in it and do it. And, and if I did something, I always wanted to make sure I do it, did it correctly. And I always wanted to be the best that I could be. Well, recently I spoke about that God had healed me from that brokenness. He had restored me. He's restored me. He's put me back on that path. The path of, the path of my destiny. The path, the path of my greatness. See, God's given us greatness, all of us on the inside of us. And it's, it's up to us to tap into it. For me, I was tapping into mine. But then when that happened, it sent me like down the slopes. And it made me where I would take the easy way out as the safety net. And I didn't want to, I wanted to protect that pain. But protecting that pain makes you not tap into your greatness. It doesn't make you push you. It doesn't push, push you to the next level. And for now and right now, God is pushing me and he brought those things back to me. I thought those things were gone. Those dreams, those talents, those passions, those gifts. I thought that they were gone. I thought they had vanished. I thought I had, oh my goodness, I had taken all this time. I didn't take time off, but I basically wasn't into it, wholeheartedly into it. And now God has brought those things back. So I want to encourage someone out there that if you're going through a brokenness, God can heal you. He can restore you. He can bring back all those things that you once dreamed of, those things that you wanted to do, or maybe you were already doing them and then something happened and it stopped you. For me, it was fashion and it was fitness. I've always loved to be in the fitness arena and I like fashion, a designer. I like to design things. I like to help people look nice. You know what I'm saying? So, and then inspire people, motivate people. And God is bringing those things back. Now I can, mm, I like to have that mm, in it. If it don't motivate me and if it don't, if it don't inspire me, that's why I've never wanted to do things based on money. I've always wanted to do things based on the things that I have passion for, the gifts, the talents, the greatness. God is the healer and he can restore you back to anything that you lost or any dreams or goals that you think has passed you by. God is the restorer. And he can restore you. God bless you. Take care.